Okay, so for today, I have got some larger plans going on. We are nearing towards the end of the base, so we are going to need a lot of stuff, and I've been preparing quite a bit, and we have this much stuff. Quite a bit of cobble, so I kind of want to end cave, if that's the word, this main island here that we have and it's gonna be about three or four times the radius of the entire like area that we have here so it's gonna be quite big probably up to around here-ish i reckon on screen right now is the bit of the plan that i've got right now so this is like on the left screen this is the coordinates as they are in the game so i've got the current base here and this should all be to scale uh, this is the current base we've got here this is the floating island area that we have and this a uh, purple circle is going to be where the new top-down view of the cave will be, like the outline of it will be. And on the right screen, this has got a radius of 143, which is exactly that, that circle there, but just in block form, <laughs> if that's the right word. So the reason why we have so much Iron is for buckets. Anyone anyway, thinking, that's a bit of a strange thing to get done, what are you doing? You weirdo <laughs> and it's because we need to get lavar why are you in here cats oh there's so many cats in here oh why why, why is why are they in oh no <gasps> kiki that was horrifying right well i guess we'll Get on with it. Oh, I could have saved the cat. I could have saved the cat. <laughs> oh, cock. Uh, damn and blast. So, what we need to do is we need to bridge out 143 blocks in some direction. So, I'm going to build a cobblestone ring around this area here that has got a radius of 143 from like this point here pretty much so all the way around there 143 blocks out on that ring we're gonna pour lava over the top so it all like flows down then get water put the water over the lava that will all pour down when that happens the lava will turn to stone or cobblestone i'm not really too sure so it's gonna take a while to do but hopefully it'll be worth it and that is kind of what i'm hoping for but yeah, that is the general idea that I have for this first little bit for now. And that is it. We have done the outline of it. It took, oh god, about 40 minutes in total maybe, give or take. Alright, now for the even more boring bit. Now for probably the most boring bit of this entire series. We have to go to every single cobblestone block, and there's quite a few of them, and fill up every single one of these with lava. If I fall in here, oh my days, I will not be a happy bunny. Okay, now you have to wait for this to go all the way down to the bottom. Okay, it looks like it's all done. So what we have to do now is very quickly pick up all this lava and then fill this all up with water. Water, water, no, water, and then water. And then water. Okay. And that's gonna cool off the lava that's there, making a cobblestone wall. Okay, right. That doesn't look too bad. Obviously, this is gonna be a very repetitive process, and chances are I'm gonna do this off camera because, oh my god, watching this, editing this back will just be torturous, probably. And I kind of want to save myself the time and effort. So, oh god, see, this is why these episodes take so much longer to make than the first ones I made. So, I guess I'll see you once we finish. Wish me luck. <laughs> oh god, this is going to take ages to do.
Okay, right. So it has been around three hours and I'm pretty sure I've nearly finished. All I've got is this last mini section here and unless I've made a drastic error, I'm pretty sure we're done. So we'll just get this little bit done quickly and then we'll have, oh God. Then we'll have a bit of a look, see? And have a look what it looks like. I was originally considering just to fill all this up with lava, make a new nether portal here and then just fill it all up with lava and then just pour water all over it. And maybe that might have been faster, but I don't really know how the nether portal thing works with like linking. If I were to make one here, I didn't want it to link with the one we've got over at the village. I think the lava has reached the bottom, so we'll pick these bits up. I think that's all of them. I'll just pour this all over in water. See if we miss any of the bits. I don't think we have. And we'll... Try and make our way down. Oh my god, yeah, this does look colossal, doesn't it? Oh my god, that looks cool. Uh, I think I left this as the gap to the village. So I've, I've left that there as it is purposefully. I did make a mistake. Yeah, <laughs> I made a bit of a mistake earlier. Uh, there are a couple of lines that I might have missed as well here and there. But yeah, I think for today, I'll leave it there and I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so I wanted to spend a bit of time talking about how far we've come so far already in the world. This is the 11th episode, I think. We've just started to work on the proper base now, and it is definitely much bigger than I thought it would have been. I thought this might have taken maybe a week or two to make, but it is taking a lot longer than that. But yeah, we also just got 10 subscribers as well, which I think is really cool. Also, some of the comments that I've got uh, recently are just really nice and really sweet. I wanted to say um, thank you for that as well. I've been responding to every single one and I'm pretty sure I've got it. I don't think I've missed one yet. If you do comment and I don't respond incredibly quickly, it's probably because I'm sleeping. But yeah. All right. I think we might be done. It's taken about 10 hours in total, maybe, just to get the roof done. And it looks pretty cool. What I'm probably going to do is whack in a bit of glowstone here and there. I think it's better than using torches. But yeah, that is the base so far. It's taken us a while, um, but yeah, I'll see you in the next one.